What's good, YouTube? You know what it is. Your man Jinx back out here. About to come at y'all with another segment of Jinx Peace Kitchen. Hopefully, y'all like the previous video, the Swearing Chef Jinx Peace Kitchen segment. You know, I actually picked that up from somebody I seen on YouTube years back, and I don't know, it just hit my, it just hit me in the head, and I just wanted to do it. Some silly stuff, but whatever. But we about to go cook some salmon, some curry rice, mixed vegetables. And we about to get it in, so let's get it popping. Alright y'all, let's get started. Right here I got two pieces of salmon. I've just been having it soaking in some um, lemon juice for a little while. About to drain this out. Excuse the cord, I gotta use my headphones right now because it's late. I get people asleep. I normally don't eat this late, but I haven't ate much all day. I'm kind of starving. Okay, if you want to pat your fish, you know, what is the sound you want to pat it dry? I know y'all probably look at my video and like, this dude is ghetto as hell. Broken plates. Look at this plate. You don't even like. I just use it for a prep plate. You know, so soon or later I'm gonna throw it out. But for now, just a prep. Excuse the cord. Told y'all, gotta use it right now. All right. So, this is all I'm gonna put on it. Rub some olive oil in there. Follow it up with some Caribbean fish seasoning. And that's it. I might throw a little pepper on it. I like my fish a little peppery. Pepper's better than salt, for you, so. Alright, let's get the. Some oil on there. The oil up in there. You can use butter too if you want to, but. I don't really feel like fighting with the butter right now. Yeah, so. Plus, I like the color when you put oil on it how it gives to the fish well depending on what you season it with if I didn't find that Caribbean like if I didn't find this I would use the Creole seasoning the um is it Tony Sriracha or something like that the only thing I really season my meat with besides ribs I got like a rib rub I got a rib, rib rub for that Caribbean seasoning or whatever seasoning you put on your fish. Yeah, throw some of that up on there. Yeah, I'll probably like that. Yeah, that is a lot. Nah, that's cool. Trust me. If y'all know any other good fish seasonings, you know, some of that are a little bit more healthier, low in salt or whatever, uh, let me know in the comments below. I need to switch it up. This Caribbean season got a lot of salt in it, though. I know it, though. It's not a dietary type of seasoning. But I like the way it tastes, though. So. Season it. Then we're gonna take it over to the air fryer. This is gonna be real quick because this don't really take no time to cook. And the air fryer is even less. Um, should I do that? Yeah, I'm gonna do that. So, you know, you can rub the seasoning in if you want. So we did that with the other side too. I'm gonna put parchment paper inside with mines. Um, Cause I hate cleaning these after. It's still gonna have to be clean, but just not as much if you would if you just put it in there by itself. All right. Put the, put the 
salmon in there. There's enough oil on it. I don't really gotta spray the parchment paper, but I am gonna spray the top to lock in the um to lock in the seasoning. I wish I had like some lemons that I could put on top, let it cook, but that's why I put it in the um the lemon juice earlier. So I have that lemony flavor on top of the seasoning. So let me get the spray, set the air fryer. We're gonna cook it and then we're gonna get started on the mixed vegetables and the rice. All right, so as y'all can see, this is in the pan ready to go. I'm gonna set the air fryer to about, I don't know if y'all can see that, but I'm gonna set it to about, I can barely see that in my glasses. I'm gonna set it to about 360. I'm gonna put it up for about 12 minutes and then come back and check it out. Spray it. Put it in the air fryer. Do about say, 12 minutes. Run around it. All right, so I'm about 12 minutes in. Go check it out. Oh yeah, that's, oh my God, that's looking really good. In between, I threw some smoked paprika on there. So that's that coloring that you're seeing, but it's taking on a good color on its own. So I'm gonna give it another, let's see, like maybe five minutes and then it should be done. It's gonna be good. All right, so right here we got some curry rice mixed in with some california blend mixed vegetables and um this is actually you know i didn't even make a whole new thing of rice because i had rice earlier so when i did the um swearing chef so i was just like you know what, let me just why waste it you know what I'm saying? all right people and that's the finished product you know what i'm saying if you enjoyed this video like comment subscribe hit that post notification you'll never miss an upload and all um, yeah man i'll be back for more of these this looks so good. This is too much to eat right now. I, t I do have a smaller plate, but this is going to be like my lunch for tomorrow. I'm going to eat half of the other fish and a little bit of rice. It's too late. This looks good. The bomb diggity. So 360. Mine's was gone for about maybe 20 minutes of total runtime. 15, 20 minutes. You know what I'm saying? Check it after the first 12. You know how to make your rice, you know how to make your vegetables, it ain't rocket science. Just, yeah man, do your thing. Alright y'all, peace.